Hey guys, so today I decided I want to go ahead and try printing a Christmas tree on the GTEch A30. Um, recently I went, I picked on, went on Amazon, I picked up this light. Uh, it's got a little remote control to it. You can just hit the on and it'll change colors. You know, you can have it where it flashes, you can have it where it's supposed to strobe, but uh, I think you have to turn up the speed. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, that'll, <laughs> that'll do all kinds of stuff. But it's a pretty cool little setup. But uh, at our local mall, I saw this uh, Christmas tree setup. I'll see if I can get a picture of it. And if I can, I'll, I'll pop it up right now on the screen. But when I saw that, I, it looks like it's 3D printed. And I decided I wanted to print something like that. I figured I'd just go ahead and print it on the A30. Uh, it's going to be about 300 millimeters tall. It's not going to look exactly like the one at the mall, but it's going to look pretty cool. Anyway guys, let me go ahead and get it started and I'll see you at the end of the time lapse. Well, I don't know for sure, but I believe it was just under 12 hours of printing. And it came out great. There's just a kind of a difference between down here and up here. I honestly don't know why that is, if except for the speed probably slowed down. And that probably, the temperature difference, who knows, made this more of a frosted look than that part. Okay, perfect. It came off the build print print build plate just fine as you can see one of the modifications i made is i'd actually put a hole inside that and the reason for that is so that i could use this light so let's go ahead and see if the light will work now i'll put a link to this in the video description uh where i found it i got a four pack off of amazon i believe it was like 16 bucks for four of them and good size just right and when I poke the on button, there we go. Let's go ahead and turn the light off and see how it looks. Ooh, pretty. That's exactly what I was hoping for. <laughs> that is so cool. That is exactly what I was hoping it would look like. And the A10 did a, just a terrific job on this. I'm really surprised at on the overhangs. Everything turned out great on this model. I dig 3D did an awesome job on, on designing this. I'll put a link to their their model in the video description. You can find it on Thingiverse. Did a great job. And this was using Cura on spiralized contours. Just did an amazing job. Well, guys. Thank you very much for watching. I want to wish you all a Merry Christmas, and I'll be seeing you in the next one.